Just come on back over here a minute, man. Just a minute. We got just a few more minutes here. I tell you what, that was such a blessing. Thank you. I mean, I could sit and listen to you all all day. You're great. I mean, don't go, don't get the big head now. Okay. <laughs> don't let me, don't let me get the big head. But I mean, really, I just, I just love to hear good singing, you know, and something that I can feel the spirit in, because I think that's exactly what we're needing today. Mm -hmm. And I mean, you all travel a lot, don't you? Yeah, we do. Uh, have you been in a lot of churches, or are you more just doing the singing part? Yeah, we've been. I in, mean, well, you're, I mean, not just singing, but singing in like. Uh, events or something. Yeah, we've been in a lot of churches singing. I like to tell people that I'm a Baptocostal witness. I got a Baptist head, a Pentecostal heart, and Jehovah Witness feet. Amen. <laughs> Do you feel, I mean, I know a lot of people that say, you know, they can go to, um, now my church, um, we have the spirit. I mean, you can feel the spirit in there. But, I mean, I've, I've heard a lot of people say that, you know, a lot of the churches are dead. So do you ever have that? I mean, when you start singing, can you see them like kind Actually, of like you know, I was very curious about, you know, the different types of churches and everything. And thank God we've been able to go out to different churches. And each church is different in its own. Some churches you go in, you'll see people that they jo more they reserved rejoice. Or they're, they're more reserved. They rejoice inside of their heart. Yeah. And then you go to some and they get up and move around a little bit when the spirit gets to moving. And and personally, I kind of like the ones where they kind of get up on their feet a little bit. It kind of helps well, you the know, singers you, out. Uh, um, can feel uh, it coming from other people and you can see them, you know, feeling God in, in, in the spirit, then that makes you, I mean, you can you can do more, right? It, it flows. It makes it easier it for you. It flows from breast to breast, it, from heart to heart, it goes out. And, you know, whenever we're out there and people are rejoicing with the Lord, the, the Holy Spirit comes in and it starts changing people and they see, well, hey, there's something going on here and I don't quite real, you know, realize what it is if they're not a Christian and then all of a sudden they see that Spirit starts working on them and they can see that. And if you're in a church and you know people are sitting there and God calls you uh, in your spirit, hey, get up and, and shout or say amen. Don't hold it back because you might be the one amen that gets the whole service turned around and changed and yes it's uh it's very difficult to sing in a church where you know the people are rejoicing in their hearts but they've been kind of taught that over time to just to really if you if you move in the church or your people are going to look at you funny well they looked at Jesus funny and exactly. you know a lot of those people did but you know he withstood the persecution and if the Lord tells you to do something by all means do it right well, are you really proud of him? Yes. <laughs> and you too, because, I mean, you're involved. How can I, mean. I not be? <laughs> and now and now you're starting to sing together. So, yeah. you know, people are going to recognize you as a uh, as a team yeah. there yeah. Yeah. instead of just him by himself. It was kind of hard to sing with him at first. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's kind of hard to follow me because, you know, the thing is, is with, with Michael's music is it's constantly evolving. Yeah. And it's never the same. Uh, you, you sing with the spirit as if you were preaching. And you might be in one service to where that God says do it this way, and mm -hmm. then you might completely change the way you do things and be a little more upbeat with it. But it's basically coming from the heart so much as it's not script. Right. I'm not doing it script, uh, a script version of it. When I go out, so I you don't do know, what, you might say something right. in there. Yeah, I say exactly. something in the middle of the song that God puts on my heart. So kind of the way I look at it is, is in a way it's kind of uh, preaching. Uh, singing and being a comedian all at the same time and that's what I like about Michael Combs was he was all three amen he he made you laugh uh he would sing uh, like an angel and then you know he would uh, break it down and you would eventually get to the point to where that your heart would be convicted with the spirit and at the end they would end up with a few people saved and I really enjoyed that. I really did. Yeah, well I think our time is up and I appreciate y'all so much for coming. I know you come a pretty good way from Morristown, Tennessee. Yeah. And uh, I, I'm just so excited about what God's doing in your all's lives and I know he's gonna continue to bless you and I thank you so much for coming. Well thank you. Thanks for having Thank us. you. You're